Apple is marketing their new Apple Watch Ultra as the ultimate adventure watch. But in today's video, I'm gonna share with you five adventure watches that I think are better than the Apple Watch Ultra. Let's go. My simple criteria for compiling this list of five watches is that each watch has to be rugged and it has to have a wide variety of functionality that lends itself for taking adventures Number two, and very important, each watch had to have great battery life. So all of the watches on this list are solar charging watches, and so they last for months at a time, not just merely hours. And then number three, I wanted all the watches on this list to be cheaper than the retail price for the new Apple Watch Ultra, uh, which comes in at $799. US dollars. At the outset, I want to mention that four out of the five watches on this list are not smart watches, at least as we understand them today. Um, and so some might dismiss this list right from the outset and say it's illegitimate as far as alternatives go for the new Apple Watch Ultra, which is a smart watch. But rest assured that all of the watches on this list are very capable and they're all built for adventure. Even though they can't receive phone calls or connect to the internet, each one can take whatever you throw at it. By the way, I never understood the need to wear a tiny smartphone on your wrist when you carry a larger and more capable one in your pocket. Just saying. All right, so in this list, I have five watches that I think are better than the Apple Watch Ultra. One is super budget friendly. The second is also budget, but more sporty. The third is large and serious. The fourth leans into the smartwatch realm. And the fifth is an actual smartwatch. So the first on this list is the Casio ProTrek PRG270, which can be had for less than $150. I actually own a blacked out version of this watch and I have for many years and it's really been a great beater watch for me. You can see the dimensions and some of the key specs as compared to the Apple Watch Ultra. Most notably for me is that nine month battery life with normal use on a solar charge. And the thing is, as you wear the watch, it will continually be exposed to sunlight and artificial light and constantly be charging but it will go for nine months at a time, even if it wasn't being charged by light. I won't mention all of the features, but it has an altimeter, a barometer, a compass, a thermometer, and 100 meters water resistance. Next is another budget-friendly piece and a sporty option. It's the Casio ProTrek PRG30, coming in at around $160 only. It's slightly smaller than the PRG270 that we just mentioned, but it has all of the same functions as that model. So it is also a very capable adventure watch. Number three, we step up in size and into more serious looks with the Casio ProTrek PRG340, which has a retail price of $330. This watch has all of that same great functionality as the last two ProTrek models, but this one comes with a nice titanium band. And with the solar charging in this watch and the previous watches, you get amazing battery life, which I think is one of the most important features of all of these adventure watches. Number four, we start leaning into the smartwatch realm with the Casio GBD H1000. This watch has a retail price of $399. Now this is a massive watch, as you can see by the dimensions. It's over 20 millimeters thick, so I would not feel comfortable wearing this on my tiny wrists but it has the same functions as all of those previous ProTrek models, but it goes further. This watch has GPS, it has Bluetooth, it has a heart rate monitor, it has a step counter and workout tracker as well. This watch has solar charging, but it also has USB charging. If you use the GPS and the heart rate monitor consistently, the battery will last you 18 hours. 
If you don't use those functions, it can last for up to 12 months. Last on the list, number five, is the True Smart Watch. It is the Garmin Instinct Solar coming in at 499 US dollars. It has good dimensions for being a smart watch and has a plethora of functionality just like all of the previous watches we've mentioned. Of course, this watch being a smart watch has GPS, it has fitness tracking, it has heart tracking, sleep tracking, and it can be paired with your smartphone. As far as battery life here, there is solar charging as well as USB charging. While using the GPS, this watch has a battery life of 48 to 370 hours, depending on if it's in battery saving mode or not. If you're not using the GPS and you're only using the smartwatch features, this watch can, can go up to 65 days with its battery life. So that's my list of five adventure watches that I think are better than the new Apple Watch Ultra. Honestly, my gripe with any smart watch being called an adventure watch is the battery life issue. I think if you're gonna have a true adventure watch, it ought to be one that can be charged by sunlight or artificial light. But you guys let me know what you think about that and let me know what you think about this list of watches. Tell me which one is your favorite, and if you still love the Apple Watch Ultra better than all of these, that's fine too. Share all your comments down below. And if you want to see a watch reviewed that is mechanical, that is automatic, and that is also an adventure watch, I encourage you to watch this video right here. But please give this video a like. I thank you for stopping by today to the town watch. We'll see you next time.